I'm saving it. Episode 2. No, we are up to episode 3. Yeah. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of no. anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. Nope. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! Kenny! What the fuck?! Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Yeah, she's dead. The cannibal killed her. People in the dairy farm killed her. It's just like, ah! The Walking Dead, Episode 3. It's a train catastrophe. The Long Road Ahead, Episode 3. Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. Definitely. I don't like Kenny. Kenny's a coward. Blown coward. You made up your mind yet? How's that bullet headed? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Maybe we split up. Could split up. So you stay with Lily then? And Carly will stick with your ass because you saved her that one time. And I get who, Ben? That gangly shit for brains? Split up. Really? I don't like Kenny at all. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave oh. much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Yeah. Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Uh, bring on the truck, the barrel, push the jeep, maybe. Mm. Probably with the brakes on. They're blocked by all the Window. fallen concrete. Ooh, there we go. Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. When push comes to shove, he does have a point. But... It's not... The right point at the right time. If he turned, then do it. If he didn't, then there's still a chance. Why am I doing this? 
I don't know why I'm doing this. Your girl still upset with oh, you that's taking what. stuff out of that car last week? Probably. I haven't asked. You even talk to that girl anymore? Of course I do. Clementine, what do you think? I could climb up, but I want to see what's underneath. Absolutely dog shit. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. What did he say? Uh, what did he say? He wanted to know if Herschel's son somehow made it. Pretty sure he knows he didn't. Don't worry. You made out like a hero in his eyes. It's not like that. You're sure you're nope. up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Shit! Ow. Really? Jesus. Are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shocked. Now get off here. Well then. Don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Don't shoot. There's no point. It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. <laughs> He's gone. Gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. No, we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she took two, buying us time. Yeah. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Yeah, she he does have a point, so I'm just gonna leave her. I don't like it, but hey, it's survival and she's already dead anyway. Already had to make a choice. Is the alarm gonna go off again? We should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Much time now. Oh, sick. Energy boss. I'm back here too. Energy boss. Supplies. Supplies. More supplies. I think that's everything. Awesome. That girl didn't die for nothing then. Up and over. We're still clear. Let's Quick hustle. and easy. Oh, Jenny, help! Ow! Get this door off me! Danny, really? Danny? Fucking get out! 
again, again, do it. Do it again, do it again. One more time. Get off me. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Oh my god, Kenny, you're an absolute dick. some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. Ah, it's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. Really? So, what did you get? Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. This place is fine, Kenny. I know we gotta go eventually. At it again, It is. We? Can it, Carly? Yeah. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable in- Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily's concerns are valid, you know. Of course you think they are. God damn it, I'm not on anyone's side. Kenny, this is about everyone. Uh. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We got plenty of food from that station wagon. Yeah, no thanks to you. You didn't even want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? Sorry, she was dead was anyway. Happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! What? Happy Kenny? Happy My Kenny. family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great Good. stress. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! What? Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. 
Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. Definitely not. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Sure. Let me just go speak with Clementine first. Is she falling for me? I think so. Okay. So, let's go talk to Clementine first. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See? It's the same. Um, kind nice. of. Nice. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. <laughs> do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Alright, now I go talk to... Thingy. It's Lily's room. Yeah, no shit. Hey, Lily. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Uh, I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. It could be For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? It could be Ben. I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke yep. around a little bit. Thank you. I can't read them properly. Because I'm a slow reader. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? Why? You're the Grace Detective, and I could be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. <laughs> I know who it is. Ah. Uh, fine. You can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. <laughs> Cute kid. So I have a light bulb. Missing. Okay, I'll talk to Thingy now. What's up? Talk to Lily yet? Yeah, she thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Uh... What about? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve Why? to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. P 
people need to know because we're Why? hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. It's a, it lifetime, a lifetime ago. ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. Whoa, it's... It's gonna so cause it so then? much uproar. Fine. I don't like it, but I have to. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Fine. You'll thank me later. Oh. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Uh. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high rise apartment and hand me a full bodied Malbec, and then I'll feel safe. I don't know. This place <laughs> is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Yeah, it could. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. Well, Kenny's you know definitely not going to have it's a very good opinion it's about me. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. <laughs> Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Huh. Okay. Clem knows. Okay, no. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. It was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car. I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Sorry, Clem, but... Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> nice one, Clementine. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's got to be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? Yeah, I just need... It. I'll talk to the wife first. Then Kenny. I was, uh... on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you, uh... Knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife... Uh, That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. I was given Larry CPR with Lily. Kenny came in from out of nowhere and... 
put a stop to it. What did he do? He smashed his okay, head. <gasps> Making the wrong choices. Gotcha. And I can't. Everything keeps changing. Yeah, it does. Hi, guys. I'll talk to Kenny this time. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? It's gonna really hurt it's our relationship, but okay. I, Should I it's sit already down? broken. Come on. I was uh, on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? No. Oh my it wasn't. god. We got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? No. Good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Yeah. See? It's already broken anyway, so there's no point on mending it. Did you Do break you a flashlight? this broken <laughs> flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Thank you. This is a big help. Who's over here? Ah, no, it's the broken eye. It's broken glass. There's some broken glass on the ground there. behind over here. Absolutely nothing. Hmm. Yeah. It's the same broken glass. Why is there an X there? Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Duck. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could, it be. could be. It's pink chalk, <laughs> which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Clementine was with some chalk. But I don't... I don't think it was Clementine. There's no way that it could be Clementine. I think it's Ben. Yeah. Hey Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... Well, my thoughts. And I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. He's a bit shaky from that question. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? Ah. No, no, it's okay. Psst. Lee. What? I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. Oh. I was calling the scene for clues. <coughs> yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. <laughs> yeah? Cool. <laughs> did you you break, didn't the break the flashlight, the flashlight did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Yeah. There it is. Chalk scuff. 
Yeah. Somebody was over here too. See, I did good, huh? Yeah, Duck. You did you very did. good. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Some supplies in it. Get the supplies, Lee. God damn you. Son of a bitch. Found him. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, Got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the Real biggest day. mistake of your life! <sighs> shit. Enough of this bullshit! Drew, stop putting your boots in these doors! Yeah! Hold it, asshole! Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we gotta! That's why! Okay. Uh... What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up or I'll... Christ! Oh shit! Oh shit. Get back there! Smoke him out! We gotta get out of here! No shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Shit. He's back there. Gotcha. There's another one there. Oh shit. No, there's another one over there. Put your head up. Shit. God damn you. Put your head up. Put your head up. Oh. Oh, oh my god. Controls are so bad. Get back there! Smoke him out! <laughs> we gotta get out of here! No shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Okay, got oh, one. Shit, the brain is back there! Now! Ah, get gotcha. over here! Hurry! Ma'am, you saved our ass. Get inside! Yeah, I just keep fucking going. Hi there, me! Help! Katja, hang on! <laughs> what is it coming in now? He's right behind that van! Get your ass to the Katja, hurry! Come gotcha. on! Clint, get inside the RV! Come on. It's gonna be okay! Go! Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh Christ! They're not bit. 
Then they get in the RV. Screw her. Let her stay. Fuck you, Kenny. Shit. Let's go back and forth. Back and forth. You can do this. Get down here! Billy, come on! Yes. 